Hi, I'm Lindsay Baumgren of Nourish Move Love, and this is your abs and cardio Metcon. Part of our Metcon program, which you can get when you hit subscribe to our YouTube channel. Or better yet, hit that join button and become part of our YouTube community for more accountability and support. All right, you guys, welcome to day nine. Whoa, look at that, day <laughs> nine of Metcon 100. We are so pumped to be here with you, rounding out the last couple days. And today we are coming at you with core cardio and mobility. We did this on week one and it was such a fun one. I'm excited to be back. I have the amazing Rachel. Hi. She'll be offering modifications throughout today's workout. We have just one dumbbell today, guys. You know I love a good one dumbbell workout. A 15 pound and a 20 pound, grab whatever you have. I'm gonna be using a box. You could use a chair, a couch ottoman, a couch, whatever you got. Rachel's gonna show you how you can do everything without the box as well. So pick your level. Your workout looks like this. You have four circuits. Each circuit has two moves core and cardio. You know we love non-traditional core, so get ready for that. Core and cardio, you're gonna do each move for 30 seconds of work, followed by 15 seconds of rest. Repeat it times two, and then you're going into our move of 100 reps, which today is bicycle crunches or overhead marches with Rachel. If you don't wanna crunch, you can stay standing. If you're with me, you're doing 100 bicycle crunches. If you're with Rachel, you're doing 100 marches, overhead marches, all right? And then you get a sweet surprise, 50 seconds of mobility in between each circuit, which is really awesome. All right, you ready to do this thing, Rach? I love it, I like this format. I'm I excited. do too, <laughs> core cardio and mobility. It is gonna be a fun workout. Let's get ourselves warmed up so we can jump into our, our time here together. All right, we're gonna start, we're gonna take you through some of the moves you're gonna do today. So let's start right foot forward, left foot back, find a nice staggered stance. You're just gonna give me a staggered squat, down and up, down and up. So 80% of the work is right here in that right foot, 20% in this kickstand back here. You're squatting, nice, squatting. Can you get a little bit lower with each squat? This knee is tracking towards my outer three toes, right there, chest up, eyes up, right here, nice. Squat it out for four, hold low, in three, you got it, two, and hold it here, hold it here, take this foot a little bit farther back, get loaded in this front leg, add those arms and run it, run it, run it. I gotta switch my arms, there we go, there we go, nice. Nice, bigger the arms, bigger the arms, the better. Drive, stay low in that front standing leg. Give me eight, seven, six, you got it. Five, four, three, two, one. Getting after it today, feet come parallel right here. Big inhale, reach up, exhale, baby back bend. Just take it right down into a forward fold. Reach those fingers for those toes. You can even tuck your fingers under your toes. Drop down, deep squat, hips go high. Deep squat, as I deep squat, you notice my toes go out a little bit. As I stand tall, toes come back to you. Little deep squat, nice, and hips high. Just getting warm here, opening up those hips and opening up those hamstrings. Nice, open the hips, open the hamstrings. One more, one more, open the hips, open the hamstrings, hold that forward fold, pull it up, flat back, nice flat back. You're still hinged, shoulders parallel to the ground. Shoulder swimmers here, arms go, palms down, reach out. As you come around, flip the palms, palms up to the back. Halfway, flip them, front, now make it seamless. Woo, there we go, a little high five today. <laughs> little high five your partner. Some shoulder swimmers. Palms are up in the back, palms are down in the front. Nice, taking those shoulders through a nice good full range of motion. While those hammies are still turned on, low back turned on, nice hinge position, core is tight. Nice, give me one more, swim. There it is, switch it out. Left foot forward, right toes back, let's squat. Stagger squat, nice. Stagger squat, there we go. 80 here, 20 here, nice. Drive through that front heel, down, up, down, up. There it is. Can you get a little bit deeper with each squat? Final, four, hold low, three, yes, two, one, hold it here, take it back. You ready to run it? We run it, run it, run it, run it. How low can you stay in that front? Standing leg, there it is, drive that knee up. It's powerful, give me eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, two, and one, bring them parallel again, big inhale up. Exhale, this hand, time hands come to the back. Big chest expansion, interlace the knuckles. Nice, I'm going forward fold. I'm gonna drop to mat, Rachel's gonna stay standing. Dropping to my knees. Let's go right here, Rach, left arm. Left arm up, Rachel's gonna give you standing windmills. I'm gonna give them to you from the ground, so this arm's overhead. I can go hand to the ground. Rachel's sliding her hand down, right hand down her inner leg. I can go hand to the ground, or maybe I can get down, right there. I wanna challenge my mobility here. So I'm gonna go hand to the ground, then forearm, elbow to the ground. And coming up, cinching up through these obliques. Hand and forearm. Rachel's going all the way down. Nice. Sliding her right hand down her right inner thigh. We're keeping our gaze 
on this left arm up here. Gaze on the left arm. Nice. One more, one more. Take it down. Nice. Bring it back up. Right there. Let's go right into it, other side. Right into it, other side. So this time, right arm up. Left arm's going to go to the mat. You can just start here. Just meet the mat. Come back up. Cinch up through these right obliques. Left hand can meet the mat. And now, can you challenge that elbow for him? Right? If you're with me, this is a new move. Option to take it with Rachel standing today. We're going to be holding a dumbbell in this arm overhead. Dumbbell is optional. If you don't feel comfortable, don't go for it. Or start light. Maybe you start with five pounds. Use what you have today. Nice. This knee is going to be slightly out for me. Give me some nice room and range of motion here to work. Nice. Go for one more, Rach. One more, one more. And then come meet me on the mat right here in tabletop position. Tabletop position. Little cat cow. Drop the belly. Reverse it. Tuck this right up towards the ceiling. Come to a neutral spine. Can you find a pigeon cat cow? So left foot's going to loop in. Right there, it's a little bit of pigeon action. Right here. Left ankle going to be against left knee. Or sorry, left ankle against right knee. Drop the belly. And then reverse it. Spine up towards the ceiling. Feel this hip open. Drop the belly. One more. Spine up towards the ceiling. Feel this hip open. And drop the belly. There we go. Switch it out. Other side. Pigeon. Nice work. New moves. New mobility moves. That's love what we it. love in our programs. Ready? Drop the belly. As you pull that spine up towards the ceiling, tuck the chin. Feel this hip open. And then drop. Nice. You'll feel the hamstring or back of the hip. And then when you come here, you feel the front of the hip. Front of the hip when your hip when your spine is up. When you drop the belly, back of the hip. One more. Front of the hip. And back of the hip. Nice. Unwind yourself. Come right here. We're going to go into a bear crawl or beast crawl. Hold. So my knees are going to hover off the ground. Hover here. Hover for three, two, one. Drop, reset. One more time. Lift and hold. Hover. Pull that core in nice and tight. Nice job. Rachel's going to drop her knees and go into bird dog. If you're with me, I'm going into a kick sit, opening those hips and opening those hips, reaching opposite hand to toe, rotating my hip all the way through, kicks it through for four, three, two, and one. Nice work. Both people tuck the toes, heels go, or hips go high to the sky. Nice little down dog action here. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Nice. Shift forward, find a high plank. Hold it here, hold it here. Now drop the belly, open up the chest, roll the shoulders back. A little up dog action, that feels good, right? Tuck the toes, hips go high. Walk the hands back to meet the feet. Roll up one bird at a time. Rachel's got high knees. I'm gonna come to my box. We're gonna warm up those hip flexors for marches and bicycle crunches. Go eight, seven, six, you got it. Five, four, three, two, one. You ready, Rach? I feel good. We are warm. And we are ready to jump in. Grab a quick sip of water. You're jumping into circuit one. I'm gonna be using my box and my 15 pound weight. All right. Rachel's gonna show you how you can do this from the ground. First move, single leg squat. Um, let's go ahead and start right leg on the ground. I'll do my hard leg first. Right leg on the ground. So Rachel's gonna go right foot forward. Single leg squat and up. As I squat, I push that weight away from me. Rachel's got a staggered squat right here, 30 seconds. 30 seconds, you'll rest for 15, and then you're gonna keep that right leg is gonna be the tension, right leg's gonna be the tension. I'm gonna run, run, run on my box. Rachel's gonna run on the ground. Yes, say yes, this is gonna be a fun one. Let's go, core, core, this is core. Right foot on the ground. We go in three, we go in two, and one. So push that weight away, drive through the heel, stand up. Push the weight away, drive through the heel, stand up. Single leg squat with a dumbbell press out. Nice, it's called distal core. I'm pushing the dumbbell away from my body. <sighs> nice work, there it is. Drive through that heel to stand you tall. Like we said, this is non-traditional core training, right? 10 seconds here, and then we're gonna raise that heart rate. <sighs> You're not just dropping to that box, you are controlling the squat for three, two, and one. Dumbbell down. My right foot's gonna go on the box. This is gonna be challenging because I got a nice high box here. Stay nice and loaded here. I'm gonna run, run. This is gonna be big arms, cardio. We go in three, two, let's go. Raise your heart rate, raise your heart rate. 30 seconds, plyo runs, woo, right here. Come on, you got it, woo, nice. Oh, if you did legs with us yesterday, you are feeling this in your right standing leg. Yes, they're like, wait, what? My legs are still on fire, 10 seconds, yes, come on. Push, push, yes, final four, 
Three, two, one. Holy bananas. There we are. Holy bananas. Circuit one. Circuit one. Circuit one, grab your weight, other leg. This time we're squatting on the left. Squatting and running on the left. Woo! Catch your breath, we go in three. We go in two. Let's go, single leg squat, push that weight out. Nice, drive through the heel. Squat and press. Nice, nice. If it's easy for you, you can lower that box. Lower that chair, that bench. Drive through the heel. Single leg squat, unilateral work. We know engages the core. All those small stabilizing muscles, right? 10 seconds. Catch your breath. Time to pick it back up. In four, three, two, and one. Nice work. It's really hard to turn to the side and talk to you guys. Every time I do, I lose my balance. All right, left foot on your box if you're with me. Left foot on the ground if you're with Rachel. Knee drives, knee drives. In three, two, let's go, let's go. Drive, drive. Gotta get my arms right. The Ooh. arms help. <laughs> I don't know why, yes. but they do. <laughs> nice. Bigger the arms, higher. That. Heart rate. Nice. Drive through the heel that's on the ground or on the box. Yes. Feel those legs. Fire up for 10, 9, 8. You got this. 7, stay with it. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woo. Fire. There we go. Fire coming out of leg day. Glad we were 30 seconds and not 45, right? Same. <laughs> Same. On the ground for me, Rachel's got marches. I got bicycles. We go 20, 20. So it's one, two, okay? Rachel's every leg. Yes? We go 20 crunches. Bicycles in three, two. Let's go. So it's one, two, three. You don't need to rip through these. Faster does not mean better. Let's break it down, okay? Drive your heel away from you. Flex your toes towards you. Each time you hit elbow to knee, other elbow hits the ground. Yes, nice. Right there. Got three, got two. Last one, that's it. There you Woo! Go. Nice work, guys. We're taking it just a hair easier today, I'm not gonna lie on your move of 100, because let me tell you, day 10, it's just fire. Don't think about it yet. It's just fire. We'll cross that bridge when we get there, right? You gotta give your body a little, little, little something easier today. Although I wouldn't say this is easier. Not easy. Mobility, <laughs> deep squat, like we did in the warm up. So come to that nice deep squat, whatever feels good for you. Trust me, a year ago, after tearing my meniscus, I was not here. Do what feels good for you. And then you're gonna go forearms to ground, deep squat, and then you'll hit your butt to the ground. We'll walk you through it. Find that deep squat in three, two, Let's go, so sit back, deep squat. Hand forward, can you get your forearms to the ground? I can only get my wrists. Yeah, not forearms yet, something sit. to work towards. Right, that's why we're here. Yeah. Forward, forearms. This time you're gonna take your hands, help guide your butt to the ground. Sit here, nice and wide. Two internal hip rotations on the right, so tap the knee in and up, in and up. Now on the left, tap to the mat if you can, and up again. These moves are tough mobility moves, something to strive for. Bring your heels close to your butt, back to that deep squat, deep squat. Forearms to the ground. Deep squat. Forearms to the ground. Back to butt to the mat. Two on the right, two on the left. Two on the right. Up. On the right. I have been doing this move every day, and my hips feel so much better, you it's guys. It's a good one. I realized how tight my hips are when we started doing it. Right? You know? <laughs> one more low squat, and you are out. That's quick 50 seconds, isn't there it? Go. Feels good. Quick 50. All right, on to circuit two. Circuit two. You just need one dumbbell. We are not going to be using. Um, the uh, box here. I'm gonna take one weight, which hand? We'll go on the right hand first, Rachel, okay? So, right hand's gonna go overhead. Remember that half kneeling windmill we warmed up with? This knee is gonna be about 45, right knee. Right arm overhead, left hand to the mat, and then form hits the ground, and back up. Eyes on your dumbbell. Rachel's got the standing windmill. 30 seconds, in three, in two. Let's go, so it's slow and steady, right? You're not ripping through these. You're not gonna get through a ton of reps in 30 seconds. Right, and you're only gonna get to do each side once. So it's a fun move that you can come back to. Nice. Really think about cinching self up. So I gotta control the obliques down on the left. Cinch up on the right. Control on the left side, abs, obliques, up on the right. Nice, you're already under 10 seconds. Here we go. Eyes on your dumbbell, eyes on your dumbbell. Nice, so that's three, two, and you're up. Nice work, guys. That's our new move alert, too. Oh, keep new your weight. Alert. 
Keep your weight. Let's hit down left. Hit left, punch right. Hit left, punch right. Yes, hit left. Shuffle left and down. Three, two, let's go. Down on the left, up on the right. Shuffle, hit left. Shuffle, up right. Shuffle, down left. Shuffle, up right. Taking that weight across your midline with a little lateral shuffle to get you moving in all planes and keep that core turned on. That's what we're here for. Come on. Core's turned on, heart rate's rising. Let's go. Nice work. Right here. Down on the left. Up on the right. Last three. Two. And one. Nice work. Awesome job, team. Repeat it. This time, left arm overhead, so left knee up for me. Right hand's gonna hit the mat. Left knee out at 45. Left arm up, lock it out, lock out the elbow. Bicep by ear in three, two, hit the mat. Can you get the forearm to the ground? Drive up. So now, control on the right oblique. Singe on the left oblique. Control on the right oblique. Singe on the left oblique. Nice work, guys. Slow and steady here. Slow and steady. We're hitting the side abs, the obliques. 10 seconds. Dumbbell. Stay straight overhead. Stacked on top of this left shoulder. Nice. Drive up. You got it. Three, two, and one. My back toe is just like shaking. Everything is turned on there. All right. This time, down on the right, up on the left. Down on the right, up on the left, right? My back toe follows my hips as they turn. Okay? Hit left or hit right in three, two, let's go. Down on the right, up on the left, down on the right. Rachel's got no dumbbell. Nice work. Choose your weight or no weight, right? This is your cardio. This is meant to raise your heart rate right here. Come on and get you moving and training in all planes like the athlete that you are today. Come on, 10 more seconds here. 10 more seconds here. Back to bicycle crunches or marches in five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. Weights down. Weights down. If you're with me, hit your back. If you're with Rachel, grab a weight. We go. 20 bicycles. Four marches. In three. In two. Let's go. One. Two. Remember those cues. Toes to face. Heels to wall. Elbow to knee. Elbow to floor. It's a kickstand. Here, right there. Nice. Can you make that knee to elbow connection each time? Yes. Nice work, team. Keep it up, keep it up. Yes, you can. Right here, last two, one. You're out. Nice work, guys. I like it. Woo! Ready for some fun mobility. We're gonna come back to the wall here. I'm gonna grab my knee pad. All right, so I'm gonna go right knee, or sorry, left knee on the ground. Rachel's got left hip to the wall. Okay, right knee's in front of me. Right knee's in front of me. Left hip to the wall, left elbow to the wall. 50 seconds, spinal rotations. So I'm gonna come down as far as I can here. Nice, and I'm gonna come all the way up. Elbow stays connected, hip stays connected. Stay tight, stay tight, stay tight. And then come into extension right here, and then come back up. Ooh, that extension is hard for me. 50 seconds, 50 seconds in three, in two, one. Left hip, left elbow connected. Here we go, get your range of motion here. Whatever that is, come all the way back up. Elbow stays connected, hip stays connected. Stay tight, stay tight, stay tight, stay tight. Nice, now how far can you extend? Ooh, not too far on this side, come back. So you're drawing a rainbow with your elbow on that wall. Nice. I just took those magic erasers to my walls and cleaned up all the marks. Here we go. Now I'm gonna be back to school. Making them all dirty. Back to ground zero, 50 seconds. This is so good, you guys. Spinal rotation and extension right here. Something to add to your routine, especially me. I could use that extension work a little bit. Nice. Awesome job. Just flow through this at your pace. Remember to stay tight to that wall. You got about 10 more seconds here. We're gonna do the other side after our next circuit. For three, two, and one. Nice work. Always fun to try some fun new mobility Ooh, moves. Yeah. And if we don't build them into the workout, you're not gonna do them, right? Grab a sip of water. You guys are on circuit three. One dumbbell. One dumbbell if you're with me. I'll try and go heavy here. Let's grab that 20. All right. I'm coming into that beast mode or that quadruped position on all fours or bear. My knees are gonna hover. I'm gonna give you one dumbbell drag. The side I pull to, I kick it to. Nice, pull across. I kick it the other side. Rachel is just gonna go, there you go. Chop up your left side, crunch on the right. Follow Rachel for your standing option. 
Follow me for your floor option. It's 30 seconds and it starts in three, two. Let's go up here with me, drag it across. Kicks it to the side you drag to. Okay, knees stay tight to the mat, just hovering off that mat. Nice. Rachel's chopping just to one side and crunching. She's gonna do the other side next time. She's doing her best to mimic the move we're doing here on the floor in a standing option for you guys. Because we love standing options, right? All seasons of life right here. All seasons of life. Come on, stay strong for five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work, no weights, but you're gonna need that sweat towel. Rachel's favorite move. My we couldn't, favorite. couldn't have a program without it. <laughs> towel slams with Rachel. You're gonna jack with me. Wide at the bottom, narrow at the top. In three, two, slam it. Wide at the bottom, narrow at the top. 30 seconds, 30 seconds of towel slams. Option to add a jack if you're with me. Make it big, make it powerful. This is your cardio move, guys. It's your cardio move. Come on, raise that heart rate. Build a strong heart, equally as important as those strong legs and arms. 10 seconds, let's go. Woo! Finish it. Five, four, three, two, you're out. Woo, leave it there. Nice work. Do it again. Beast with me. Kicks it. If you're with Rachel, chop right, crunch left. You're there in three, in two. Let's go. Right here. Let that heart rate come down. Nice. If you're with me, you're working on low abs, hip mobility. Nice. Rachel's taking that weight across her midline, just like we are. And then taking that knee across the midline, just like we are right here in the kick sit. Knees are close to the mat, guys. Kick sits are challenging. Woo! You get better with the reps. That's our slogan, Metcon 100. You gotta put in the reps to see the results. Last one. Nice work. Towel slams. Towel slams. Here we go, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Make it big. Make it big, Jack with me. Slam with Rachel, three, two. Let's go, let's go. Come on, 30 seconds to raise that heart rate. Close out, circuit three, right here. Nice, moving on, moving on. 20, crunches or marches. Yes, you can. Let's go, keep pushing, right here. Last 10, woo, push it, push it. Come on, final five, four, three, two. You're out, leave it. Woo, leave it all on the mat, guys. Leave it all on the mat, here we go. With me, bicycles, 20. With Rachel, marches, 20. We out of breath yet? Woo, let's go in three, two, and one. Nice work. I know we had someone say, I think it was Sheila, core and cardio. It's just such a good combo. I'm with you, Sheila. Core and cardio is such a good combo. I love it. It's fun. Woo! This is a good way to end this week, guys. Keep pushing right here. Yes, you got five more. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice work, team. Nice work, mobility. We're going back to the wall, other side. We're gonna come over here this time. Right? Right knee is, right hip is up against that wall. Right knee's on the, on the ground. Left is in front of me. Right elbow connected to this wall. So you're gonna come down here. All the way up, stay tight, stay tight, stay tight, stay tight. And extension, 50 seconds. This is your mobility move. Get this right hip, right elbow on that wall in three, two, let's go. Take it down. Now come all the way big around. Rotation, 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 rotation. Now extension, 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 extension. Ooh, extension's hard for me. Keep that elbow tight, 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 tight. All the way down. Nice. Test your range of motion, guys. What is that range of motion for you? What can you work towards to get better? I got some extension work to do right here. Nice work, guys. 50 seconds of mobility. Feels so good to build it into your workout, doesn't it? Otherwise, it's really easy to skip it. I know <laughs> how important it is. Right? We're gonna get you nice and mobile. Because let me tell you, we are finishing Metcon 100 with a bang. This is a tough program, guys. Tough program, 10 seconds. You wanna compete at your highest level in this program? Finish all 100 reps of every exercise. You gotta put in the mobility. Three, two, 
and one. That's how we stay pain-free and injury-free. That's our goal these days, pain-free and injury-free. All right, let's take it to circuit four. Bring it home, guys. Circuit four, all right? I'm gonna use my box and my body weight, no dumbbells. I'm coming into a Copenhagen plank. You guys remember these? I might need a towel. From Stronger 25, we did them, you loved them. I'm still working on them. All right, so I'm gonna put my knee on the bench of the box. The farther I get down, farther away, like if I was here, that's gonna be harder. Okay, but I still got some knee pain right in my surgery knee, and I still have SPD pain from my babies. So this is where I'm at, Copenhagen. I'm drawing the knee that's on the ground up towards here, side plank. Rachel's just gonna give you a side plank hold, modified, okay? That's a good option, it's 30 seconds. We go in three, two, let's go, nice. So right here we're working on side abs again, obliques. You got shoulder stability. We got inner thighs turned on, your adductors. Super important for stabilizing your pelvic floor. That's why I still get pain in this exercise if I get too far away from the box, farther away from the box, harder it is, right? I'm still trying to heal a little bit of SPD pain. Woo, my pelvic floor. Just not the same after three babies. Here we go, but I'm stronger, I'll tell you that much. Five, four, three, two, and one. Do you feel both inner thighs just totally lit up? I do. Shaking? Woo! Yeah. Right? All right, cardio, you ready for it, Rach? Let's go. Rachel's got walking burpees. I've got burpees right here. I'm gonna go chest to floor burpee. Up, I'll alternate my knee, putting, er, oh, come on, word. Alternate which foot hits the box, right? There you go. So it looks like this, burpee, right foot, burpee. Left foot. Remember those 100 burpees you did in week one? You can do 30 seconds. Yes, you can. It's 30 seconds and it starts in three, two. Let's go, we saved the best for circuit four. Yes, we did. One burpee, Hoop. drive that knee. As you drive the knee, sit back, feel those low abs turn on, yes? Come on, Hoop. yes, woo! Hoop. there it is. Nice work, team, you got this. 10 more seconds of burpees. What do you got for me today? What do you got for me? Yes, you can. Last five, four, three, two, you're out. Whoo, couldn't be a good workout without burpees. I got All right, Rachel's got the timer. I'm giving you, oh wait, wait. Yeah, you can do it, right? Yeah, 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 I'll go. I'll go, no, I did say, I'll go this way. Here we go, Okay. left and right. There we go, left and right. <laughs> <laughs> Rachel's got our timer. I'll watch the timer. We I go in three, two. Let's go Copenhagen's with me. Well, you guys know Lindsay hates when she can't see the timer. She hates it. <laughs> I love to be in control. It's a confession. <laughs> I love to be in control. But I trust you, Rachel. I know. I'll keep an eye on it. Don't worry. Nice. There's 15. Oh, there we go. Halfway. Let me see if I can do the signature Lindsay count on the way down, Ashley. Let's do it. Let's what do it. What would I say if you had 10 seconds? Nine. Eight, yes you can. Seven, six, you are so strong. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! She crushes it! <laughs> yes, Rachel! I love it, you guys. <laughs> this is so fun, that's why we're here, right? Are you having fun? If you're not, you're about to. You got 30 seconds of burpees. Say yeah, baby, burpee. Alternating foot tap on that box in three, two, go. Nice work, Rach. Woo! Come on, get your last cardio segment right here. Put yourself your best 30 right here. Finish strong. Now, come on, all you got. Don't hold anything back. Not today. This is Metcon 100. We need your best. Woo! Last five, four, three, two. You're out. Way to holy go. bananas. Nice work, Rachel. I'm with you. Christina said, holy bananas. What a fun twist on an ab workout. I'm with you, Christina. No boring abs around here. No boring here. abs. No boring abs. But we, you know what we got? We got a bar over here that needs to get filled. We got to get to 100. That means you got 40, 40 marches or 40 bicycle crunches. Let's finish strong. This is it, guys. Final 40 in three, two. Let's get to 100. Here we go. Come on. Let's get there. We got 40 bicycles if you're with me. We got 40 marches if you're with Rachel. Yeah, turn those shoulders on, Rach. Yeah, come on. We're climbing to 100. You're pushing those heels away from you. Nice work. Nice work. Keep with it. There it is. Nice work. Caroline, I need a number. What are we at? There we go. Nice. 20. 
You got 20 down, 20 to go, 20 down, 20 to go. Everybody say thank you, Caroline, for counting our reps for us today. Otherwise, I think we do way more on accident. <laughs> totally. I just got my eyes shut. I'm squinting. I'm going. I'm getting through it. Nice work. This takes a team effort. We're here together as a team today, guys. Yes, we can. Yes, we are. Right here. Nice work. Final five, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. That gets us all the way to 100. Way to go, way to go, 100 <laughs> reps. Yes, you did. We did it. Yes, you did. Let's change yes, you can to yes, you did. Yes, you did. Yes, you Check did. Check it off. Check it off. That is Metcon Day 9. We're stretching, Rach. Let's do it. We're stretching. feel good. We got mobility left. We had 50 seconds of mobility. I'm going to give you your mobility move. I don't want to hold anything back from you today. Cossack, so your feet are going to be nice and wide. Toes are facing me or slightly out. I'm just going to hit to one side and give me an open. Back to center. Hit the other way and open. Back to center. 50 seconds here, guys. Just hit it side to side and open. What a good way to end this workout. Some solid mobility training to finish off your day. You got four great mobility moves built right into this. You did 100 crunches or marches with Rachel. You got that heart rate up. You got that core strong. Day nine, guys. Day nine is in the books. Remember, if you want this full Metcon program, you can find it linked in the description below. It is a tough one, but it is gonna make you stronger. I can guarantee it. Stay with us, because we got one more day. We got one more day, day 10. And I would be selling it short if I said it's nothing but pure fire. The most hype around it, for ah, sure. It's gonna live up to it, I promise you. <laughs> it is pure fire, guys. Five, four, Three, two, and one. Just take a nice wide leg forward fold here. Let it all hang heavy. Can you get those forearms down to the ground? Still can't, I'm at my wrist. Mobility challenge for me right there. Nice work. Walk those feet in underneath you. Go ahead and roll up one vertebrae at a time. Roll the shoulders down and back. Rachel's gonna give you a nice standing quad stretch. I'm gonna use my box here and I'm gonna give you what I call the couch stretch, right? Where I put one leg up against it. Come in here. We did a lot of crunches and marches. Let's open up these hip flexors. Open up these hip flexors. So you can take those arms overhead or opposite arm overhead. Nice, just think about lengthening right here. Through this right here, your hip flexor that your knee pulls up with, or that helps your knee pull up, I should say, towards your midline. Let's open that up. Nice, big inhale here. Big open mouth exhale. That feels good, right? Do it again, big inhale. Big exhale. Nice, switch it out, other side. Switch it out, other side. There we go. We love that final stretch at the end. You worked hard for it. You earned it. Nice, same thing. Pushing that hip flexor forward. Arms come up overhead. Just think about creating length through that hip flexor. Opening it up right towards us. So proud of you guys. You are nine days into this program and you are crushing it. You are so strong and I cannot wait to finish this program stronger with you on day 10. One more big inhale through the nose. Big open mouth exhale. There it is, nice work. Come down all the way to the mat, Rachel. All the way to the mat, right here. Just like we did those internal hip rotations, let's come into a butterfly now. Let's stretch those hips. Soles of the feet to meet, roll the shoulders down and back. Think about dropping your knees towards this mat. Sit up nice and tall. Nice, nice and tall. Roll the shoulders back, right there. Big inhale, big exhale. So proud of you guys. We're gonna put left hand on the mat, right arm reaches over, stretch through those obliques. They got a solid workout today. And other side. Big side body stretch. We're gonna see you back here for Metcon day 10. Have a great day, you guys. Awesome work crushing abs and cardio. If you loved it, hit subscribe to our YouTube channel. We've loaded up day 10 for you of our Metcon program right there, or get the full free program in this playlist right here. Have a great day.